Howdy y'all, and welcome back to lives. I think it's time we play a little arc. Alright, I've got my boat. My mobile base. Gonna head out here and see if I can't find a better spot to acquire the things I need. Um, I'm pretty sure what I need to do is I need to sail it all the way around. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to put a bed on this thing. That's something I've got to do yet, too. What do I got to have to... Oh, I forgot to put that stupid mask on me. What do I got to do to make a bed? I thought that was the other one, the, uh, the aberration helmet, not the weird mask uh bed 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 fiber hide thatch and oh that's not too bad i can make one of those when i got here i'm gonna assume we shouldn't have too much problem that's a terrible view We're in satellite mode, so I can look around a little bit here. <laughs> Almost looks like I'm using some kind of uh, hydrofoil. I wish you could steer in this view, like with the keys. Used to have a farther back uh, view of everything. Um, I forget when they changed that. I uh, greatly preferred the farther out view. But you know, I can always put her into satellite view and take a look around. Take a look at my crazy mask. <laughs> uh, we, uh, ma'am, I'll tell you, I'll tell you a couple of stories about pictures today. So, uh, we're standing there, and, uh, my, dude, we're, we're on the boat, don't poop on the boat, we're standing there, and, uh, my, uh, my four-year-old niece is looking at the wall of family pictures, uh, that my mother has. And, uh, she's counting how many pictures each person has got. And she's only in, like, three of the photos. And, uh, somebody else is in, like, four of the photos. And so she's like, I want another photo of me up there. And, uh, and so I'm like, well, how many photos are you in? She's like, I'm only in three and I'm like, okay. And I'm looking. I'm like, I'm not in any of the photos. And she's like, what? I'm like, how many photos am I in up there? She's like, you're not up there. And uh, I'm like, how come there's no photos of me up there? I thought this was the family photo wall here. There wasn't enough room to have a photo of you up there, my mother says. You got three of the same people. None of me. Nice. I'm like, that's alright. I don't do photos anyways. Whatever. Uh. And then... So today, we went to take family photos. Uh, which is something we do every few years. Which I think is stupid. And, uh, so I was... I'm not a clothes person. I I could care less. As long as I am covered enough that people don't look at me like I'm crazy. 
I'm pretty much good. Uh, my standard everyday clothes are a pair of basketball shorts and a t-shirt. That's when I'm good to go. Uh, I am I'm quite content with slacker wear. Uh, which is why my new work from home job is awesome because I never have to get out of my slacker wear. When I uh, when I was teaching classes though, I had to uh, I had to dress up, you know, jacket and tie and all whole nine yards every day I went to class, uh, which varied between like three days a week and five days a week, depending on the classes and. Um, so it's nice. It's been a year since I had to put on uh, a tie. It's it's pretty awesome. And uh uh you know, I think we're we're a couple weeks out from a year since the last time I had to wear a tie. And so uh so I'm looking at my clothes and and uh you know, I've got like the one semi nice shirt that I wear when we go out places and I'm like, you know, it's getting it's getting kinda old. It's not raggedy or faded really or anything, but I thought maybe I'd maybe I'd get a new shirt, uh, for family photos and uh it's it's a little faded, but it wasn't bad. You know, it's not like there were white streaks on it or something. And uh look at this. I don't think I've ever noticed this before. There's a set of docks right here. <laughs> uh, and, uh, so I ordered a new shirt. Now, mind you, it looks a lot like my old shirt. <laughs> uh, it's a slightly different style, uh, but, you know, it's still just a black polo. That's my... That's my we're gonna go out and do stuff in a nice place shirt. I mean, yes, I've got the the dress shirts and the ties and all that if we have to go someplace really nice, but my family doesn't do anything really nice uh and uh uh they like to think they do sometimes, but, but we've never been anywhere that's really nice. Are those some of those uh dead or is that rocks that's rocks? I want to keep an eye out for those dead uh whales uh, that wash up on the beach sometimes because I could use the uh, the oil and stuff and uh, so uh, we're going along and and uh, I ordered this new shirt so like two weeks ago or no uh, they're like uh, yeah everybody better be getting some nice clothes for for the family photos I'm like oh I, I got a new shirt I ordered a new shirt I don't go to the clothes stores. Uh, and uh, and they're like, you ordered a new shirt? Aw, bless you. I'm like, seriously? It's not like I never get new clothes. It's not like I wear terrible looking clothes. I mean, bless me for ordering a new shirt. Uh, and uh, so... Uh, Mind you, my family has southern roots, so we do have some weird turns of phrase, such as one step away from, aw, bless his heart. The heart doesn't make it on there. It's just, aw, bless you. Uh, oh, 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 oh no. Hey, buddy. You, uh... Man, turn this thing is like turning a wagon. And so, uh, I get the new shirt, you know, and I'm showing... Showing the new shirt, and they're like, well, that looks just like your old shirt. I'm like, yeah, but it's new, it's... it's you know, it's a slightly different style. It's got different kind of sleeve. And why is that bird sliding all over the place? I shouldn't have pulled so close in here, man. And, uh... I was thinking of going in there to do some harvesting, but I think I'm just going to continue on my path around the outside here 
get over to where I believe are some crystals. Uh, I want to try and get some crystals. I know there's a bit in here, but I hate dealing with the dragons. Huh. You think when you guys can poop now? I, I, I take it back. Everything I said. I need a poop. Ugh, Z used to be my poop button. What's my poop button now? Let me see. What's my poop button? Uh, I don't even know what that that action's called. It's just poop. Can you not do that anymore? Do, do, do. Defecate right there. Defecate. Add. Does that mean I gotta add it because it's unassigned? It used to be Z. Do I have something on N? What about N? May see anything on N. Oh, N is tool weapon attachment. H. H is the uh, temperature. M is map. Z is Z is something else now. Uh, X is prone. C is crouch. Z. Z is order, add, remove, tame. So is there no button for poop? I need a button for poop. I'm going to make it this button. Right bracket. Oh, did I say I didn't have to? Oh, and it undid my bloom quality there. Come on, guys. When I need you to do it, you don't do it. I really need you to do it. Just somebody do it. I was going to collect this guy. We might could take this little beetle with us. I just need... Here, I know. Well, when am I ready? I just, I ate a bunch. Can I make them do it? Actually, he's just going to get a random thing here with us, so he can go with us now. Is he still there? Yep. <laughs> Alright, when one of you poops, then maybe we'll try and tame that guy. Uh, so, get the shirt, right, and I show it to him, and... And, you know, they're like, oh, it's the same shirt. And I'm like, no, it's a little different. So, today, today is the day of family photos. And I've not worn this shirt before today. And, uh, so... I... Put it on. Ugh. I put it on, and they see it. They see me in it. Uh, they don't say anything. I'm not fishing for a compliment. Look at that, I got me a little dung beetle. Alright. Uh that's not the that's not the point of this story. So they see me in it, they don't say anything. I'm standing in the kitchen, everybody's walking back and forth behind 
walking back and forth past me is the word I wanted. Not a not a not a phrase. Uh, and then uh, I put on my my jacket to get ready to leave. And uh, right, everybody sees me. I get in the car. Um, I drive to the place. We have to take two cars because there's that many of us. Uh, I I personally think we could take one car, but they refuse to believe that you can fit seven people in the seven passenger vehicle. Uh, and uh, uh, and so they only take six. Uh, there's there's a lot of times where they're, well, we can we can talk about that too. Um. And, uh, because I have a story about that from, uh, last weekend. And so, uh, so, I get there, and, uh, I wore my, I wore my normal going about shoes, and I know, from the last time we did this, like, three years ago, that I'm a lot taller than everybody else in the family, and so they often make me crouch down. And so I immediately just kick off my shoes, uh, which, you know, drops like a half inch off my height from the shoes. And, uh, and, uh, it went really quick. Uh, but they, they looked at me, not, not the guy taking the pictures. Uh, this actually made me laugh. Uh, they looked at me and they're like, I can't believe you wore a shirt in that color. It's black. It's what I always wear. You knew this is the shirt I bought. You didn't say anything before this. We're here now. There's nothing I can do about it. Maybe you should uh, do up all the buttons on your polo. I'm like, no, it's okay. I'll just leave the top one open. It's fine. And, uh, all right. And, uh, uh, and so then the photographer gets in there. That dude's also wearing a polo, but he has all his buttons undone. <laughs> And, uh, so they, they stopped talking, but they didn't like my shirt after I got there. They didn't say anything while we were here. Uh, but yeah, it was surprisingly quick for me. Uh, the rest of them aren't home yet. Uh, but, uh, the dude's like, I want you to stand here. I want you to turn a little bit. Oh, they just got in. Uh, I want you to turn. I want you to lean forward and smile. All right. Click, click. All right. The family group photo is done. Uh, we had to take one, one more group photo with a different background. Um, and then I was done. I was done. Uh, way better than the guy we had to do it the time before. Cause that dude was like, I think we're going to take one with you kneeling on this block. Uh, can you just get down on your knees? Uh, uh, you know, stuff like that. Um, this dude's just like, yeah, lean over a little bit, lean forward. There you go. Click, click, done. Like, sweet, out of here. So, uh, so we got this, uh, we got this vehicle, and uh, I'm pretty sure it's got seven seats in it. I'm pretty sure the back seat goes all the way across. I, I know the back seat goes all the way across, but they'll never sit three people in it ever, and they only put two people in there because I don't know for whatever reason. And so, when they want to go places as a family, there are seven of us, and because they won't sit people in that back seat three across that means i have to drive separate and they'll say things like yeah we're gonna go do this thing as a family i'm like oh okay i guess i can arrange my schedule for that oh well there's not enough room for you to go so I'm like okay fine we're gonna go to this thing that's like an eight hour drive we're all gonna go together uh but there's not enough room for you so you'll have to drive separate well, then I'll just stay home. No, 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 we want everybody to go. Yeah, no, you really don't, though. I'll just stay home. And uh, I don't, I don't want to go anyways, probably, to whatever it is. So, uh, uh, my sister, on the other hand, she, uh, I hate to drive. My sister also hates to drive, but she, uh, she was in an accident with my car uh driving my car uh years ago at this point and uh and so she is a very frightened driver uh and she won't let anyone else drive the vehicle she's in uh otherwise she has panic attacks 
Like, she's the one who got in the accident, but if other people drive, she has panic attacks. Go figure. And so, uh, often she will drive separate, and then I'll just ride with her when they want to go to this stuff. But there have been times where, like, no, yeah, there's not enough room. So, they want to go, they tell me they want to go see this movie. I don't want to go see it. It's a kid's movie. They want to take the kids to a kid's movie. I'm like, yeah, okay, they're not my kids, so I don't have to go to that stuff. I don't want to go see Star, okay? Uh, and, uh, so, they're talking about going, they're talking about going, they they talk to my, my sister-in-law, she's going to go, she's going to take her kids, her kids are older, and, uh, uh, I think they're like 17 and 15 now, uh, and, uh, I think that might be a little too hard to mine, but this one over here looks mineable. It's the whole reason I came out here, right? So, and uh, so, I don't think nothing of it. I told them I didn't want to go, and I thought that was the end of it. And uh, and so then. Um, then they're like, no, no, we want everybody to go. We're going to go together as a family. And so I'm like, oh, okay. And uh, and then they're like, so we're going to go. We're going to take the kids. Mom's going. So that's seven people. That's seven people in the vehicle that only fits six people. And so I'm like, well, I don't want to drive separate. And I don't really want to go to the movie in the first place. And you want to go... 45 minutes away by car and I don't even want to go <laughs> so no thanks and uh, so then we get we get up to the, the day before and at like at like uh At like uh, eight eight fifty p.m., uh, we get uh, I get a text. Only I'm busy at eight fifty p.m. on the Friday night. I don't know what I was doing, but I wasn't paying attention to my phone, and I don't have my phone on sound. Uh, it vibrates. I don't hear it. It's sitting over on the shelf where it normally sits because I. You don't need, I don't need my phone while I'm sitting at my computer, all right? And, uh, so, uh, pretty much the only time I have my phone in my hands is for work, because I have to use it for work. Uh, or if I, if I drive someplace, I take it with me for just in case. And, um, but, uh, so I finally noticed the, the blinking light on the phone letting me know that I've gotten a message. And I pick it up. It's like 12.30 at night at this point. Now, everybody's home. I'm home. They could have walked down and talked to me, but no, they sent me a text message. We're going to that movie tomorrow. It's at 10.15 a.m. Are you going or not? And so I'm like, well, I'm pretty sure that other people would rather go than me, so I'll just stay home and you all can take one vehicle. That was my reply. That's the last I hear of it. And, uh, so I'm thinking, all right, they're going to be gone by 10, 15 a.m. That means it's going to get quiet in the house. I'll be able to, to sleep. It'll be awesome. Let's get this bed made. And, uh, it'll be awesome. And... So I stay up really late Friday night, uh, reading, I think, is what I was doing. Uh, I know there was some videos, I was watching, like, something on Netflix, and, uh, I usually end my day by reading, so uh, it seems to me there was some reading in there, and, uh, so, uh, You know, I'm thinking it's going to be a nice, quiet Saturday. And so, about 7 a.m., the kids start into all their noise, which is 
horribly loud in my bedroom, and they, they don't care. Nobody in the house cares. Uh, it doesn't matter how many times I complain about it. Nobody does anything about it. And uh, they just let him go on doing as much noise as possible. Because uh, they don't care. They can't hear it when they go a uh, flight above it and shut the door. And uh, just ignore the fact that they're downstairs screaming and jumping. None of this stuff will give me fiber. I need fiber. Dude, you see any plants that look fiberish? Maybe some of these little ones here. You guys little enough to be fiber? Ugh, I just need one fibery kind of plant. Ooh, I think that's one right there. Nope. Really? You're all just trees? I know, Dodo. And, uh, so... So... Now, nobody's talked to me about this movie, right? Nobody has said one word to me about this movie beyond that text. And, uh... Uh, now, my mom had been trying to go see this movie with the kids for a couple of weeks, and it was all set up. My sister-in-law was supposed to go, uh, all the kids were supposed to go, my sister, her husband, um, and so I, I thought they were all just going to be gone, and then uh, we... Uh, oh, I left all my hide on my dinosaur. Um... And the noise just is horrible. And you know what it doesn't do? It doesn't stop. And I'm like, oh, well, maybe they decided to go to a later showing. And they're just making noise and making noise and making noise and making noise. It's about 11 I finally got out of bed. Uh, I'd planned to sleep till, like, 2, so I stayed up till, like, 6. And, uh... Uh, so I'm not particularly happy with getting out of bed at 11, and I, I get up there and I'm like, what happened to your movie trip? And they're like, we don't know. And, uh, I'm like, well, I thought you guys were supposed to go see that movie. Oh, yeah, uh... That got changed, and I'm like, when? Because I got a message at 12.30 a.m. that, uh, or at 8.30 p.m. that you guys were all going. Well, they decided to go fishing instead of going to see this movie. I'm like, but you made plans with other people to see this movie. This, this isn't a thing where you just say, oh, well, you know what? Too bad. Your plan's so sad. I've gone to, I've decided to go fishing on a whim instead. I really hate these on a whim fishing trips. They anger me. Um, all right, there we go. And, uh, you still cooking that metal? Yep, you're still cooking that metal. And so, apparently, sometime between when they messaged me and the morning... It was decided to go on a fishing trip. Uh, two of them, of the six, decided to go on a fishing trip. And so my sister did not want to take her two kids and my mother by herself to the movies. And because I wouldn't go, she got mad and canceled it and wouldn't go. And uh, this is the second time, apparently, they were supposed to go that she canceled. And... Um, and I'm just like, weren't you guys supposed to meet people when you went to see this movie? I was pretty sure I was there for that conversation. I mean, this wasn't like a family last minute thing. This was planned out in advance. I hate when you people do that. If I make a plan with you and then you cancel it last minute, I am not happy. Uh, that is beyond rude. Like, if you have an emergency, right? You fall down and break your arm? Fine. Uh, if you just decided the last minute you don't feel like going, too bad. You made a plan. I do lots of things I don't want to do. Doesn't mean I don't do them. 
I grow I grow very weary of the everybody has to be a five year old. That's what I feel like. Everybody has to be a five year old. Uh if they don't get their way, they throw a tantrum. They do throw tantrums here too. Lock doors and slam doors and I know I've I've talked about it before. I have never slammed a door to stop from talking to someone. Uh I uh I did I did once hang up on my brother one time. Uh I'm a pretty patient guy, so I think there's crystal here somewhere. Uh, I'm going to park my guys out here. I went far enough away from land that stuff isn't going to come out on land and eat them. I don't see any of those uh, uh, dinos that might eat people. Uh, what are you set to? You're you're gonna defend yourself, okay? So I want to make sure. Uh, and you, I'm gonna put out so I don't waste stuff. Okay, let's go up here and see if we can find some crystals. Uh, so uh, yeah, I don't know. They they decided not to go. And then um, I I had this conversation with my oh well, nice with my mother uh, about uh, how my sister always cancels plans. And it wasn't that long ago when we had this conversation. And uh, and I'm like, hey, you know, she always, always cancels plans when we make them. And uh, my mother's like, no, she doesn't. I don't know why you say that. I'm like, because she cancels almost every time we make a plan. And it's infuriating. Because I go out of my way to do stuff with other people. And then they cancel at the last minute. <sighs> I can't get up there. And I'm freezing to death, as usual. And, uh... It's infuriating. And so... You know, my mother's like, I don't know why you say that. You need to stop saying that. She doesn't cancel plans every time. She's a busy person. I'm like, this isn't like... This isn't like, hey, I come up to you in the, the middle of the day and I'm like, hey, you want to go to a movie right now? This is like... So, in two weeks, uh, do you have the afternoon free? Yes, I do. Well, then in two weeks, I would like to go to this movie. And then the Wednesday, a week and a half later, she makes other plans. And uh, I guess I should have unloaded some of this stuff before I came up here. And, uh, and she thinks that's okay because it's just me. And, you know, my, my time and plans don't matter. And so, so then my mother is like, this is twice, twice she's canceled on me now. I'm like, oh, really? Hmm. Well, that seems odd for her. <laughs> uh, what's the matter? Did someone, did she cancel the plans she made with you at the last minute? She never does that, you told me. All right, I didn't say that, but I was thinking it in my head. I was thinking it in my head while she was complaining about how this is the second time plans got canceled to go see this movie at the last minute by my sister. Uh, who never, never does that. Never does that. It wasn't even a good reason. She just didn't want to take her kids... She decided she didn't want to try and handle her two kids by herself, is what I was told. And I was supposed to go to help corral the two children. And because I wouldn't go. Not that anybody anybody talked to me and said, hey, they're going to go fishing. We need you to go. I would have gone. I would have gone if I'd have known. I just didn't want to drive by myself to see the movie. And so I'm like... I'm pretty sure the other people would rather go see that movie than me. I don't really want to see it. 
but there was never a conversation. There was just a fine, it's canceled then. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, well, I'm going to call it here, so click like if you like, subscribe to sure and catch the next one, and I will talk to you later.